In today's video, I'm going to be showing you where you can get free assets for your video projects. But first, I'm going to show my brand new intro. Hello, I'm Avery. This is Online Income Network. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you MixKit. It's a place where you can get free video assets for every project that you might have, especially if you're using Premiere Pro. This has free things like transitions, lower thirds, titles, things like that that you can use. If you're not using Premiere Pro, they still got things like free stock videos, stock music that you can use. So they still have something for you to use even if you don't use Premiere Pro. And I would have to say, if you've seen some of my other videos, you know I've been trying to experiment with some of my lower thirds, seeing which ones I might like, which ones I don't like, and I came across this, and I think we have a winner. <laughs> like, this website really does help with making things a lot faster as far as finding something professional looking. And I'm talking about a lot for this intro, but let's go ahead and actually show you some stuff. Like you can see that I'm on stock videos right now, but you also have stock music, you have Premiere Pro. Now I'm not gonna go over much of stock videos or the stock music, but I do wanna just tap on it a little bit, you know, just to show you what they have. So going to stock video, I'm only staying on this page, but MixKit has a good couple hundred stock videos that you can use. They're all placed in different categories like food, nature, so on and so forth. You can see they got one going through the tunnel. Got one, somebody, oh, hey, how you doing? They see you so long. You got that one, you got the, <laughs> you got the one with uh, the highway situation. Hey, so you got a decent amount up here. Going out of that, we got the stock music. Let's just go to uh, jazz. And since the, all this is completely free, I'll be able to use this without being monetized. So let's go ahead and listen to one of these. Just quick, quick. Yeah, it's all right. I mean, it sounds professional. It doesn't sound like nothing crazy, right? So let's go to, let's just go to a romantic one, right? At any point in time, you see it, it says download right here. So I can just go ahead and download it. And you got that. I can just download it. That's it. See that? So you just saw me download it. You ain't see me. I'm not signed in or nothing like that. So let's go ahead and actually go to what I really want to get to, which is Premiere Pro. And let's just go ahead to, uh, let's go with some lower thirds very quick. Like this is the one I used. This might be the one I use a lot. So you might see that one. I don't know which one I'm gonna use yet. <laughs> so you got a lower third right there. Yeah, this lower third, that lower third. Yeah, so. As you can see, the ones that you just saw, they look professional. So, and then you can still edit it a little bit in Premiere Pro. Like you can use different fonts. You can uh, change up the color of the little line that's in there. So, yeah. Let's go to transitions. So we can see that transition here, the multi-circle, multi frame, frame split. Got a static. So if you want the static situation to go, you got that one up here, another static one. Not bad. You know, they just got a lot of different ones. And then you got six pages of this. Let's go to four. Got the twist. So you might have seen me use that one a couple times. Got a right sideways swipe, left sideways swipe. Now, like I said, I mean, I can't really say no more than what I'm saying right now. 
it's just a lot of different ones that you can just go through and then you know just figure out which ones you want to do and then you can just go ahead and download it as soon as you see it see that dude with <laughs> i just want to say that dude with like the tootsie roll little pop and dip that just i find that hilarious if you don't know what the tootsie roll is i mean just look up tootsie roll song for, you, for some of you younger folks Okay, so we got the fallen box transition. That's kind of cool too. But let's go ahead and say I wanted to actually implement one of these into Premiere Pro. I'm going to go ahead to one of my downloads. I'm open up this file. I'm going to go ahead and extract this here. We got the mix kit 341. I'm going to go to Premiere. And I'm going to go to effects at the top. Go over here. It says install graphics motion. And I'm going to find that in the lower third. We got 341 here. Press that. It says file already exists. Do I want to confirm overwrite? And if I don't have it already, which I clearly have the joint. So, but I'm going to go ahead and confirm the overwrite. So now you got it down in these templates over here. Now, I ain't saying that's the one I want to use right now, <laughs> but you can see I got other ones up here. That is one I want to use. Let's see if I got, okay, Matt Tyler. Let's use this lower third. Go ahead and just drag it and bring it over here. You can see that it's off center right now. But clicking on this right here brings up the tile over here. And also, since I'm already on effect controls, I can go ahead and make this smaller. I can bring this into view first by changing the position and the scale. That's good enough. Let's go ahead and see how it looks. Now, yeah, it looks the exact same, which is great let's do something else with it though let's change it up so i'm going to have a green portion of it so now you got that being green now it says the tail right here so let's make the tail red like a light like a lighter red or something so yeah that works and i'm actually going to change the name from matt tyler to my own name, Avery Harris. Change that and that. Let's go ahead and render this so it don't look all choppy. And it's taking a while, but eh, you know it is what it is. Yep, and you can see that I already used one of these lower thirds in a different video. But let's go ahead and check this one out. Avery Harris, got the green, got the red. I mean, I just like it. I like it. I might end up using that in a new video. I might end up using it for this video. I don't know. I mean, did I use it for this video? <laughs> did I use it for this video? I don't know. I'm not sure. But, uh, <laughs> nah, I use it for this video. I'm gonna use this one. This is the one I'm gonna use. But you already know that. So, yeah, like I was saying, uh, I like them. I got a question. Which one were you most interested in? Were you interested in the stock videos, stock music, or was it Premiere Pro? Like, and let me know which one it was. Was it the transitions, the lower thirds, the titles? Let me know in the comment section below and hopefully you found this video useful and if you did why don't you go ahead like subscribe share with a friend click the bell notification so you get notified when new videos come out from me because i make new videos every week thanks for watching